I think this is a fairly new new concept. Uh, at least it was for me. It, initially, as I started this project, I didn't know that it was going to be burned. Um, but I don't mind doing anything, I mean, something new. It's okay, I think. I, I, my, my friends thought it was a bit crazy initially, but I don't mind doing things once. It's hopefully will be the last one I have to burn, but um, I will, I'm okay with it, I think. But we'll see when we're on location and, having, <laughs> and looking at the painting. For me, art is my lifestyle. I, wherever I am, even if I'm in the car, sometimes I'm constantly on a lookout for different angles, different things to paint, different atmospheres. Wherever I am, like even if I'm traveling away, I revolve my life around it. Not just when I'm searching for a subject, but also in the studio. I dedicate all my free time to painting or sketching or, yeah. I'm Debbie Bonello. I'm a full-time mother of two boys, but I love painting and this is what I do most of my free time. I'm from Meliha originally, but I live in Baltan. Uh, Meliha is very special to me and this painting revolves around Meliha, so I enjoy doing that. It's a road I grew up in. Um, I walked through it every day when I was a child, going to my grandma's house from school. And I paint most of the time. It's a full-time thing I do now. I started painting or drawing at a very young age. My dad is a sculptor and I was always surrounded by art. But then I studied to be an art teacher and so painted solidly for like the past five years. Um, I try to do something small every day just to not lose that um, freshness or uh, uh, I don't know what to call it. Just to be confident because it does reflect in some brushwork. If you stop for a while I find it very hard to restart. So I get my inspiration from various things. It can be people sometimes. It can be a face. It can be my kids. It can be food. It can be anything. It's, it's, it's so varied. And I don't know what mostly captures my inspiration, but I think my body of work shows that I'm interested in many different things because I like being yeah, vast and various in, in what I do. I can say this is the only painting that features a car. I tend to, when I normally paint landscapes, I avoid including cars um, completely. I, it's not something I enjoy doing, and I think I can probably safely say that this would be the only painting that features a car in it. I normally start my projects um, by going on spot, on location, and taking various angles. In this case, I did not paint it on location because uh, the angle is in the middle of the road, so I couldn't stay there on location. So I took photos, came to the studio, started different sketches just to get a feel of what colors I'm going to be using. As a medium, I generally like to use um, water-based oils. Um, for my final paintings, it's a medium that I grew to love. A bit like, you can use a bit like watercolor and a bit like oil, so it can be very effective, I think. And then, you know, from the sketches, I move on to the painting. So that's my process usually. I had no idea <laughs> that these things are happening now and things are changing in the, you know, technological world. And I did have friends like, giving me a, a face of shock. Why are you going to burn the painting? You know? But now I understand the whole um, 
something behind blockchain and how it's going to be digitalized. I'm not sure how I'll feel as I'm seeing the painting um, getting burned, but we'll have to wait and see, I suppose. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, but I'm okay with it. for coming, actually, eh? this is makes it even more special.